Wow. pretty high. Okay, that is just too much ambient heat. We're melting the building. However, that was pretty impressive output. Very stable on the upper end. Not too great on the lower end. Let's try a lower end test. Very stable on lower end. I'm gonna do one more output test. incredible high output on this thing definitely not a low output device I'm not gonna market it as that or sell it for that 
but if you need to heat a couple of tons of sand in a couple of minutes this is going to be the burner design to get you down the road We got a pretty cool series coming up on these burners. I'm going to do several different calibers of this bullet burner, different lengths. I'm thinking of going from 50 caliber down to 22 short, maybe uh, 22 long, regular 22, a little tiny. Uh, basically, it's going to be the Zeus burner, burning waste oil. We've never seen that yet, and people keep asking me if the steam gun can run on diesel and waste oil, and the answer is no. Not without a pump. You can't use gravity-fed siphon systems when you're moving your arm up and down. If you move your arm up, the flame goes down. If you move your arm down, the flame goes up. So it's it's kind of one of them things there. So I've never bothered trying, but we are in fact going to build a miniature waste oil burner that looks just like that 45 caliber. We're going to call it the 22 cal. So this is the uh, combustion chamber that I have in mind. This is the sample piece that I use to make a jib. A little form tool that I use to make these. I just slide this over the top and beat the crap out of it. But this is uh, definitely going to be the 22 caliber waste oil burner, the, the bullet burner. This ought to be kind of interesting. I think it's a little long personally. Maybe we ought to shorten that up. 